you know, I've always lived around here since I was a student, and it's a very dynamic, exciting neighborhood. So I, I came out one morning just to, um, to walk the dog, which is my normal routine, and um, I looked up and there was a for rent sign in the window, and this had been a Chinese laundry. The first few months, six months, to particularly maybe eight months, uh, people would come in with their laundry and be really disappointed that it was a bookstore and say things like, this used to be a really good laundry. So we thought, you know, this was, this was very troublesome f for us at the, f at the beginning. It was difficult. And then also people would have been away for six months and come back and they had left their shirts here and we didn't have them. So that was a problem for a while. Hey, Donna. Okay. We're regarded, I, I, I mean, it's not something I think about. I mean, it's my natural environment, uh, but we are regarded as quaint. Oh. Hi, how are you? Great, yourself? Good. The Fodor's Guide uh, to Montreal uh, suggests that it's a quaint place to visit when you're visiting Montreal. 1690, And they'll phone me and they'll ask, does the owner still have a beard? Does the owner still add up things in his head? Does the owner still have a rotary phone, which we have, which works perfectly well, but, you know, it's regarded as a curiosity now. And we, we also have no cash. It's just a drawer here, which you can just open. Um, Thank you very much. It, it works fine.